Hello everybody, E here, back again with another book review. This time uh, for, I read, uh, I guess book club, whatever, um, I read with uh, Taylor Talks YouTube channel. I'm going to put that up there first. And I'm going to wait a minute, because it takes like five seconds for that thing to pop up and go away. And then next, Jen Bernardini, up here also. So keep an eye out there, go check out their channels and their reviews for this book. Um, anywho, what we're talking about today is... The Abominable, sorry, I, I, every time I say this, I, 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 The Abominable by Dan Simmons. Um, I'm a, I'm a big fan of any book, story, movie, game, anything like that set in cold environments. Um, but this one let me down. I'm not going to lie. Uh, there was so much build up to, to the end, and then the end came, and it just kind of petered out. I would say this book is at least, and I don't complain about the length of books too often, but I would say this book is at least 200 pages too long. Um, I think it's 663 pages. I'm pretty sure I know the exact page count because I kept on checking to see how much longer. Yeah, 663 pages. I don't know if you guys can see that. 663 pages. I kept checking to see how much longer I had because it was so bad. Um, or so, It wasn't really bad. It was... It was it was tedious. Uh, there's a lot of stuff in here, a lot of technical aspects of climbing equipment, the type of boots, the type of axes, uh, people have invented new new tech or whatever you want to call it, and it just goes on and on. And then you finally get to the end, and it was so anticlimactic. Um, even uh, JB, well, Taylor Talks and Jen uh, Bernardini, uh, they might be surprised. I'm going to go all the way down with two stars for this one because after thinking about it for almost a week after finishing it I just didn't care for it all that much and by Goodreads standards that means it was okay and that's pretty much how I feel about this now if you want a good Dan Simmons horror novel this is more a, a thriller I would say um, a historical thriller if you want a good Dan Simmons horror novel in cold environments that's even referenced in this one uh, check out the terror it's also an AMC uh, miniseries, but that book is 200 pages longer than this one, and it feels about half the size of this one. But anyways, that's it. If you've read it, let me know. Uh, definitely check out um, the two people that I linked to at the beginning of the video. If you missed that and still want to check them out, links should be down there in the doobly-doo. Until next time, I have been E, you have been you. This has been another book review. I'll talk to you guys later. Bye-bye!